Hello there, Raw folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of Raw news and analysis, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel for a Raw update that's sending shockwaves through the monarchy. It seems the drama never ends in the Raw family, and this time the spotlight hungry Harry and Meghan screaming in envy. Why? Because King Charles is set to upgrade the titles of Edward and Sophie Wessex. I mean, I can literally hear the crockery flying in Montecito. But stop right there before we disclose the details. Subscribe and hit the notification bell guys believe me you are not going to want to miss this so in the midst of the royal family drama of 2023 the less showy members of the firm have been quietly going about their duties but hold your breath because edward and sophie wessex the unsung heroes of the royal year are about to get a royal upgrade courtesy of charles on his brother's birthday, King Charles decided to mark the occasion by giving Edward and Sophie the prestigious titles of the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh. These titles hold historical significance previously belonging to their father, Philip, who passed away in April 2021 at 99. But here's where the plot thickens. Instead of keeping the titles, King Charles has chosen to turn them into life peerages. This means they won't naturally pass on to Edward's son, James, the Earl of Wessex, and... My oh my, the controversy begins. Daily Mail role commentator Richard Eden didn't mince words, calling it a mistake. In his opinion, what better way to celebrate Edward and Sophie's importance than by upgrading their title? He even suggests that it could encourage their son James to join the firm, a subtle dig at Harry and Meghan's questionable commitment. But the drama doesn't end there. Former role editor at The Sun, Charles Ray, weighed in on the debate, disagreeing with the notion that the title should be passed down according to him. When Edward Sophie's time comes, the title will revert back to the crown and the monarch of the day decided who to give it to. He brushes off the idea of making it hereditary, pointing out that we don't know whether James is even interested in working with the family. With a nonchalant tone, he mentions the growing royal youngsters, George, Charlotte and Louis, who will be stepping into royal duties. By the time they turn 18, he implies that there might be enough working roles by then. And just when he thought it couldn't get more intriguing, Ray drops a bombshell about the suggestion that the title of the Duchess of Edinburgh should go to Charlotte. He questions the relevance of making it hereditary, suggesting that Sophie and Edward might not care about it. So here we are in the midst of a royal debate that's raising eyebrows and shaking up the monarchy. Charles' decision to upgrade the titles has sent shockwaves through Montecito, with Harry and Meghan left to wonder why their own relevance in the royal family is dwindling and why others are getting the royal treatment. So guys, what do you think about the news? Let us know in the comments and we'll see you next time for more Royal News and Analysis. Bye for now.